The suicide hotline is 1-800-273-8255. Again, the suicide hotline, if you're having trouble, please go get help. The suicide hotline is 1-800-273-8255. I want to talk about Ryan Day, the head coach at Ohio State. He's heading into his fourth year at Ohio State. And I learned something about Ryan Day that gave me a new appreciation for him and made me uh, gave me new love for the guy, a coach who I never knew that much about. And I knew he's won a lot of games, but I also felt like he kind of inherited a good program. And here's something that I didn't know about Ryan Day until this last week and that I think might give you the same new appreciation for him. When Ryan Day was eight years old, his father committed suicide. His dad was 31. Ryan was eight. And that really, really obviously was a hard thing for Ryan Day as a child. Now, as head coach at Ohio State, Ryan Day has made mental health a priority. For example, he upgraded the support for the football team at Ohio State. He, you know, there were once three part time staff positions that he made into four. Four full-time mental health professionals that were hired to help assist the football program. And also, there's a lot of video out there of Ryan Day, I didn't know this, speaking very openly and honestly and, and telling people that if they're struggling, they need to go get help. And he even told the story about how for a long time during his life, his father committed suicide and he suppressed it and held it down. And then one time he was visiting a high school and learned about the problems they were having with students um, taking their own life. And was like, I got to deal with this and I got to speak up with this. I got to do something I I can to help this cause out. And I just had no idea that Ryan Day had this side to him. And I, I watched a video where he talked about a process that I know well, which is that when someone in your life commits suicide, you go through a process of you're kind of, you're in pain and you're numb And that turns into anger. And eventually, hopefully, you grow enough where you reach a point of empathy where you just want people to get help. And one guy that Ryan Day helped was Ohio State lineman Harry Miller, an offensive lineman at OSU. Before the 2021 season, he reached out to Ryan Day and got help. And Harry Miller says that Coach Day and the Ohio State staff saved his life with the support they built, the help they gave him. And A, I saw a video of Harry Miller being interviewed. And I just appreciate how open and honest Harry Miller was about his struggles. And um, I think he shares because he wants to help other people. That's pretty cool. And then B, Ryan Day said something I loved, which is that vulnerability is part of good leadership. (laughs) And I, that quote right there, on top of all the other stuff I learned about the guy made me really love him. Cause I totally agree. I think when you good leadership and when you, you can't expect other people to open up and be vulnerable and get to a deeper level if you don't do it yourself. And man, have I gained respect and admiration for Ryan day as a leader and as a football coach, you may know, uh, suicide is a very important topic to me. My brother committed suicide in 2016, February 8, 2016. I found my brother and I'm still very much messed up from it. And my my brother, I think, in his passing, left a wake of destruction behind that the people who loved him had to deal with his friends, his family, me, my mom, my brother, my dad. And so I want to encourage you, man, if you're struggling, please go get help. Um, and, And go get professional help. Go see a counselor. I wish my brother had. The suicide hotline is 1-800-273-8255. The suicide hotline, again, 1-800-273-8255. If you're struggling, go get help. And as someone myself who struggled and had a lot of uh, hard times and had thoughts myself about suicide, um, I know that sometimes it feels like you're not worth helping or you're not worth saving. And I... I'll, I'll, I understand that. I hope, take my word for it. If that's what it takes, I hope 
you even if you believe that, just listen to Zach and go get men, go get professional help. It it goes so far, and I just I don't want the world to lose more people like we lost my brother. And so if you're struggling, the suicide hotline one eight hundred two seven three eight two five five. Please go get help. And uh, man, if you're a football fan, next time you look at Ryan Day, I hope you look at him a little bit differently with a little more not only empathy but also admiration for being so open and honest and vulnerable about something that's really hard to talk about. And uh, again, if you're out there and you're having a hard time, don't do what my brother did. Please don't. My brother suffered in silence and never told anyone. I am begging you, go get help.